Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing well today. I know I am. Um, if this is your first time here, hi, my name is Ileana and I am on my debt-free journey trying to pay off over $105,000 in credit cards, car loan, and student loans. And if you're a returning subscriber, hi, welcome back. I'm so glad you could join me. Now, today is a video that I know a couple of you wanted to see of what I'm doing with my stimulus check. And I had done the video for it. And I was going to, I was going to edit it and upload it. But things kind of took a turn, you know? So I did receive the $1,400 and I got that late in March. So that's why you didn't see it earlier in the month. So, but I had, as you guys can see, I had made a plan. It was going to work out well, but things changed and I changed my mind. You guys would have seen what the change is if you are following me on Instagram. I do tend to update a lot more on there than I do on my YouTube channel, just because it's easier and it's so much fun to just put pictures up and do all sorts of stuff. So if you're not already following, please follow me. I'd love for you guys to see what I'm up to. So I received $1,400 and I had planned to put 1,000 towards a bed because if you guys have been following me, I am moving and the bed I'm currently in is definitely bad for my back because I do have herniations in my lower spine and in my neck which does not go well with my bed <laughs> my bed is starting to sink so that's what i had planned for this and well let's just say that plan flopped it was is not happening now now i do have a plan for to get the bed still but when it comes to the stimulus check I changed my mind. So the second um, part of my stimulus check, I did use, I put $300 towards sinking funds, which if you guys saw my Easter basket <laughs> cash stuffing, I'll link it somewhere in the eye in the sky. That's, you saw what happened. It was a cute little game. I'm thinking of another one for my next cash stuffing, but we'll see. Um, so I put it towards that. So that did happen. So the other thing was I was going to put a hundred dollars towards target. Well, instead of a hundred dollars, that didn't happen. Instead of a hundred dollars, I put the $1,000 towards target because I only owe 1680 and change. If you guys saw my debt tracker video. So I put a big, I put all this money towards, and trust me, it was so difficult. I kept going back and forth, back and forth, because I was, I really wanted to keep that money in my bank account because I liked seeing all that money there and knowing I had the cushion just to keep myself good in case something happens. But I really am determined to pay off my debt. <laughs> so thousand dollars went towards my target and I was honestly wrestling with taking out the three hundred dollars from my sinking funds I really was because that could have taken out a big chunk but I was like nope it's staying in there so that's what happened with the one thousand and the one hundred I kept for myself I know should be putting all your money towards debt I know but hey, I'm human. I the check was for me and I put almost all of it towards debt or my sinking fund. So, I figured taking 100 bucks is not going to make that much of a difference at the moment. So, $100 went to me. So that is what happened to my stimulus check. Now, I currently, after the $50 payment from Target, I currently owe $630. I have not been below the 1000 mark in like years since I think I opened the card. 
so it's just a beautiful sight to see and i do have a plan to pay it off hopefully hopefully this month so i can be done with it by the summer oh can you guys can you imagine me being done with my credit cards oh oh that's gonna be fun so yeah that's what happened with my stimulus check i know it's not a very long video i pretty much got to the point of what happened I am happy I put a thousand dollars towards Target, which I had not planned to, but hey, things happen and I would rather put all that money towards getting rid of debt than towards a bed right now. <laughs> but trust me, when I wake up, I regret that decision <laughs> because of my poor back and my spine. <laughs> but you know what? I did some calculations. Once this is paid off, hopefully by this month the snowball money that i get that i do have i'm going to save that up for the next i think two or three months so i can get a good tempurpedic bed my mom and my stepfather have that because they have my mom has spinal issues um she's had surgery all over the place my stepfather had surgery on his neck so that tempurpedic bed is like pillows like so soft so i am going to get one Especially since I'm in a new, gonna be in a new house by then, I can't wait. But I can wait another month or two. I've waited this long. I'm gonna wait another month or two. So I'm just so excited to tell you guys this. Um, how did you guys do with your stimulus check? Did you guys get a stimulus check? I know a lot of people didn't. Did you do something fun with it? Did you spend it on your kids? Did you? use it to pay off some debt or fill your sinking funds let me know i would love to see what you guys did if you have a video i'd love for you guys to link it so i can watch i love watching these stimulus checks where you guys put it because i just find it so much fun <laughs> to see other people pay their debt or just spend it on their family i like to see where people's minds are when it comes to this free money free money so let me know. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to hit that like button. And if you want to join my YouTube family, please subscribe. I would love for you guys to see my continuous progress because I am trying my hardest to pay this debt off as quickly as possible. And I think I'm doing a pretty good job. So I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye guys. <laughs>